please vote on the build we're doing right now. And uh, I, in the meantime, I'm going to go to Riverwood. There he goes. Looks like he's gone for good this time. Wow, this is looking great. This is looking great. Okay, cool. Why? This, this texture is great. Look at this. Cool. That looks really like an like a rough mountain road. That's awesome. Um, so one of the big things that I'm excited about for this. You know, you should go to Windhelm and join the fight with Free Skyrim. Is finally having mods now that I'm on PC. However. Okay, Ulfric knows about the Stormcloaks. Got it. Um, but anyway, as I was saying, this, uh, I'm really excited for mods, but we're playing the first one without mods. But I just want to, um, point out how annoying it is that vanilla, this looks so good, that vanilla Skyrim has no way to skip the tutorial. How is that even a thing? Seriously. I know it was 2011, but still, how do you have an unskippable tutorial? Or at least, like, the game should have been set up so that you could skip it. Okay, so you could skip the tutorial the second time through, right? Like, if you're going to make an unskippable tutorial because you want people to play through it, give them an option once they've played through it once. To, to not play through it again. You know, Oblivion had that ability. But why there's not a, you know, a confirmate a build confirmation at the end of the tutorial, like Oblivion had, is just it just blows my mind. Wow, look at that view distance, huh? Look at that lake. I, I can say that the, the game. The yeah, we'll just pick um, just pick Warrior for now. Look at that. I tell you what, the view distance that I'm seeing here, I was worried it would make the game feel smaller, um, but it, it hasn't so far. Um, and I think that's mostly because of the way the world is constructed. Like, there's a, a mountain kind of in your view, like in right in the in the middle of your view, almost everywhere you go. Right. Nice water. Uh, it's not the most amazing water I've ever seen, but that looks pretty good. It's pretty good. That's passable, right? Very passable. Remember, this isn't Stormcloak territory. If we're ahead of the news from Helgen, we should be fine. As long as we don't do anything to see. <laughs> Yeah, um, okay, whatever, Rayloff. I almost consider this walk to Riverwood part of the tutorial, because uh, although you can leave him earlier, um, it almost doesn't make sense to you, because Riverwood has so much... It's kind of the place you want to be. Why are you coming for me? I gotta remember to use that shield for something. You like pure waters better than this, Sela? I don't know. I I believe you. I believe you that it's better. Still, this looks pretty good. I mean, no complaints from me. I I'm not looking. I'm not gonna be looking for any uh, visual enhancements anytime soon. Cause this looks great. I I don't see a need for it. I'm going to be all about the uh, immersion mods and mechanic mods and um, content mods is what I'm really looking for. 
Graphical mods? Nah, this is fine. This looks great. Looks really nice. A dragon. I saw a dragon. You saw a what? What is it now, mother? <laughs> oh, I guess he I guess we go to the mill, don't we, right? Because Gerder owns the mill. Did I see you talking to Sven? Maybe not. Maybe never mind. But I would I'm not gonna talk to you right now about Sven, dude. So, Sela, when you get a chance, look at the uh, list of. What are you doing here? Huh. Look at the list of builds I put in the straw poll and see if any of those work for you. See if you like any of those for this character. So this is our character, Idis, and um, I'm thinking that I, I kind of went really, I kind of went a little too beautiful on her face, I think. I think she should have been just a little bit rougher, but she does have some character, so it's not too bad. The Imperials ambushed us outside Darkwater Crossing. Like they knew exactly where we'd be. That was uh, two days ago now. We stopped in Helgen this morning, and I thought it was all over. I had us lined up to the headsman's block and ready to start chopping. The cowards. They wouldn't dare give Ulfric a fair trial. Treason for fighting for your own people. All of Skyrim would have seen the truth then. But then, out of nowhere, a dragon attack. So, a necromancer, you think that's the best? I didn't believe it myself. And I was there. As strange as it sounds, you'd be dead if not for that dragon. So, okay, I've got to come up with a good backstory then for her. Any ideas? Nobody else has come up the south road. Maybe we can lay up for a while. I hate to put this Let me know if you can if you can think of any any cool um you and your friend are welcome to stay here as long as you need cool ideas for her backstory. Any friend of Raylov's is a friend of mine. Here's the key to the house. Stay as long as you like. If there is anything else you need, just let me know. She loves dark magic. Okay, yeah, I I agree. I agree that that I've gotten that far. The problem is Necromancer is the one that was the most generic. Like I, the other ones, I all I all had like a little, uh, a little bit of a an inkling of where to go with that story. But um, I'm just gonna take her healing potions. There is something you could do for me, for all of us here. The Jarl needs to know if there's a dragon on the loose. Riverwood is defenseless. We need to get word to Jarl Valgruf in Whitefern to send whatever troops he can. If you'll do that for me, I'll be in your debt. I knew we could count on you. I ought to get back to work before I miss, but did anyone else escape? Did Ulfric? 
So when let's see. Take more than a dragon to stop Ulfric Stormfront. I let them into the house and you know, show them where everything is. So she's got a beef with the Dark Brotherhood. Okay. I'm 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 liking that. That's giving her something. Don't worry about me. I know how Okay, so um Let's see here. I told you my sister would help us out. All right, let's go to the Rayloff family Fight or die well. family dwelling, I guess. And uh, we'll sit down and figure out her skill tree. That works. Chicken. This dude just look at me like, what? Are you crazy? Chickens! Ooh, chicken's egg. Why did the lighting change on that so drastically when I clicked it? That's weird. Hmm. I hope to see. Dalos guides you. Okay. So we're gonna sit here with Rayloth and figure out her skill tree. Okay, so. Let's say then that she has um, this is a necromancer build. Okay, so that's five major skills: conjuration, alteration, enchanting, one-handed, and alchemy. So uh, let's see what time is it? It's eight p.m. So she's going to. Eat a little food and get some rest. Definitely a little wine. Bread and. I guess pheasant breast will do. I think that's uncooked, so that's kind of gross. <laughs> we can get some goat. We can get some cheese. Nah. Keep your eyes open. I, think, I think she's just going to go to bed. I think she's just going to go to bed. Because she's tired. And that was a long night. Okay, so it's 6 in the morning. We can get some more. We're going to get some breakfast. And... Hey, Rayloff. Okay. Hey, Rayloff. I hope to see you in Windhelm. Good luck. Um. How do I get to White Run from here? Am I going to White Run? Let's let's say we were on our way to a different town. Let's say we were on our way to. Is it Falkreath? That's close. I think it's Falkreath. Okay. So, yeah. I'm going to rest up here a while before heading to Windhelm. Be careful. All right. Later, Rayloff. I'm going to get out of here. Okay. So, we're going to go uh, to the shop and sell some stuff. Actually... Let's get back in here. Can I help you? Okay. Let's actually change out of our clothes into some other clothes. So I think we're going to go with the novice hood and novice robes.
Right. Okay. And what do we have on fur boots? Yeah. Okay, cool. Perfect. So, um, chat's asking what my PC specs are. And uh, this PC has a 6 core Xeon processor. And the graphics card is a GTX 970. Not a 970Ti, just a regular 970. And this is full ultra specs. Like, I, it's not even... Everything's turned on. Well, I don't know what you overheard, but the Riverwood Trader is still open. Feel free to shop. Yeah, did something happen? Uh, yeah, we, we did have a bit of a, a break-in. We still have plenty to sell. Robbers were only after one thing. An ornament. Solid gold in the shape of a dragon's claw. I might be able to help you get that back. You could. I've got some coin coming in from my last shipment. It's yours if you bring my claw back. Now, if you're going to get those thieves, you should head to Bleak Falls Barrow, northeast of town. I don't know why I even said that. I'm not going to do this quest. You don't have to go, do you? Oh, really? Well, I think your new helper here needs a guide. I should not have told, even said that to him because I'm not exactly. I, I don't care about any of that. By the eight, fine, but only to the edge of town. Show those thieves not to steal from Luke and Valerius. Uh, what have you got for sale? Take a look. Let's see. Okay. So I'm going to sell him all the swords. Uh, arrows, because we don't use arrows. All the daggers. All the longbows. Actually, I'll keep the steel dagger. And just basically everything here, right? I think including the shield. Um, I think I'm going to sell the shield, too. Okay. Um, keep potions and ingredients because I do alchemy, right? Um, I'm actually going to sell this because I don't know destruction magic. Book of the Dragonborn. Uh, yeah, sure, I don't care about that. And I don't care about pelts. Lockpicks might be useful, though. Okay, so let's see what he has as far as books. He has Raised Zombie, which we're definitely going to take. And he has Oak Flesh, which we're definitely going to take. So that's an alteration spell. Okay, we don't know any of these other schools, so we're going to... Thank you, Lucan. All right, so let's sit here for a second and read those books. Okay. Why do I have battle? Oh, right, 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 right. All Nords have a shout, don't they? Okay. Okay. We have to go through town and across the bridge to get to Bleak Falls Barrow. Okay. You can see it from So I have yeah, once again. Really novice skills in everything that matters. All right. So, the mountain just over the s 
So let's equip our spells though. Let's equip Oak Flesh. Or let's favorite Oak Flesh and favorite Ray Zombie. Those thieves must be mad hiding out there. Those old crypts are filled with nothing but traps, trolls, and who knows what else. Why are you turning around? Go, go. 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 Ugh. I'm not gonna wait for her. She's bugged or something. Or just annoying. <laughs> Probably just annoying. Boy, this looks so good. Okay, so we've got... Let's favorite our weapon as well. Oh, she's so annoying. She has to go through her dialogue before she gets here. Alright, so... I said we were going to go to Falkreath. Let's look at the map. No, I want to look at the map. I just don't want the local map. Okay. This is Falkreath, right? Yeah. So I said we're going to go to Falkreath. But I realize... I realize that I need to talk to the mage in Whiterun. Because I need some better conjuration spells. And Idis... Idis is going to go... Go ahead and go to Whiterun, I think. Just because it's something that she needs to figure out. Dead rabbits. What am I stuck on? Uh, yeah, that's that's the that is exactly the console command that I tried. Is there any do I need quotes or anything maybe? That's a hundred percent the console command that I tried. It's really weird. I'm gone. What what are the robes that I have, actually? Okay, it's just regenerate. That's nice, actually. That's really useful. Hmm. I wonder... Can it just not be removed? That seems ridiculous. Maybe it just maybe it's just permanent. Maybe it's just you can't remove it no matter what you do. Which like I said is completely ridiculous. Cuz I want to learn that spell as a character who's not I don't know. 
Doesn't make any sense to me. We'll figure it out. Ruining all the nature <laughs> by picking everything. Got you, butterflies. Yeah, we're not messing with that at all. We're running. Itis is not interested in that. Hello. Fortune smiles upon this meeting. What have you got for sale? Okay. Um. I think actually that she would not. She probably wouldn't deal with them. Actually, being ignored. She's kind of um. She's she definitely sides with the. Okay, so there's a mod for removing it. So clearly if someone made a mod, it's because you can't do it with console commands. Okay, that's good to know. So apparently there's a mod for removing the starting spells. Good to know. Because, yeah, otherwise there'd just be a console command for it. Halt. City's closed with the dragons about. Official business only. Gotcha. Okay. That's so annoying that you can't remove it. Um. Riverwood calls for the Jarl's aid. Riverwood's in danger too? We better go on in. You'll find the Jarl in Dragon's Reach at the top of the hill. They get all the plants. <laughs> Yeah, okay. 